After many years of successfully helping the world from many villains and disasters, superheroes like Mr. Incredible are forced to live ordinary lives when a number of lawsuits derail the government's support of superheroes. Life as an ordinary citizen for Bob, however, is stagnant and stale after his former glory days. A job at a small desk, traffic, broken vehicles, clothes that don't fit anymore. Lesson 1. Life is a mixed bag. Toils, frustrations, disasters, imperfections. We are often reminded how our broken world is not what it should be. Bob and his family try to live as ordinary citizens and fit in. But Bob can't help being a hero for people when no one is watching. Hiding his incredible strength, however, is hard to do as the tricycle kid knows firsthand. Bob can't help himself and it ultimately gets him fired from his job when faced with desperate insurance claim clients and a greedy boss. Even Bob's kids have a hard time being normal at school. Dash goes to the principal's office for causing trouble in one of his classes. And Helen is at her wit's end, trying to hold her family together. But when Bob comes back late one night after reliving his glory days with his friend Frozone, Dash and Violet find mom and dad fighting with each other. Lesson 2. Many family troubles are the results of internal frustrations and external conflicts from outside the home. When Bob gets a message from a mysterious woman named Mirage, he finds an opportunity to do amazing things again like he used to. The goal of Mr. Incredible's trip to Nomansaman is to stop an Omnidroid that has gotten out of control. After successfully defeating the Omnidroid, life's incredible again for Bob and his family as Bob gets paid to do incredible things instead of ordinary desk work. When his suit has a rip, Bob visits Edna Mode to make a new powerful suit and heads off for another mission with Mirage on Nomansaman. This time, however, Mr. Incredible is taken off guard when he is attacked by a new and improved Omnidroid and almost killed by a new villain, Syndrome. Lesson 3. You get hit the hardest when you aren't expecting it. When Helen spots the repaired tear in Bob's suit, she visits with Edna to see what Bob has been up to and finds that Edna has new superhero suits for all the Incredibles. After surviving his encounter with Syndrome, Mr. Incredible sneaks into the highly guarded facility on the island and is able to access the computer information system and finds out that Syndrome has been eliminating all of the supers and creating a better and better Omnidroid and will soon send the Omnidroid against Metroville for his own twisted purposes. Before escaping, however, Bob is captured. With Bob imprisoned, Helen goes on a trip and Violet and Dash sneak on board. After being shot out of the sky and turning into a parachute to save herself and her kids, Elastigirl transforms into a boat with the goal of heading for land. Lesson 4. Notice how Elastigirl is quick on her feet, takes control of the situation, and looks for creative solutions. Elastigirl is able to get into the island facility and Bob reunites with Helen with the help of Mirage who feels betrayed by Syndrome. While Bob and Helen escape from the facility, Violet and Dash have to fight and escape from some bad guys themselves. When the whole family is reunited, they begin fighting family style. It doesn't take long, however, before Syndrome arrives and captures for himself a whole family of supers. Syndrome sends an Omnidroid to Metroville so that he can come in and pretend to be the hero when he rescues the whole city. But his plan goes awry when the Omnidroid proves smarter than he expects. And Syndrome is knocked out. The Incredibles escape from Nobansaman by rocket with the help of Mirage again in order to save Metroville from the Omnidroid. At first, Bob wants to fight the Omnidroid by himself because he doesn't want his family to be hurt. But Helen convinces him that they are stronger when they're together. And they begin fighting family style again. Lesson 5. You are stronger when you work together with others. As a family and with the help of Frozone, they successfully defeat the Omnidroid. Just when everything seems fixed, Syndrome shows up one last time and tries to kidnap Jack-Jack. 
But Syndrome is foiled again when Jack-Jack reveals that he has powers of his own, too. With incredible success and a new family bond between them, the Incredibles forge a new future as a whole family of supers and live happily ever after. <laughs>